Hello guys, today I'm gonna be showing you how to do a villager breather. So what you need is obviously two villagers, and you need a square block. Oh, um, well, you, you, you need this like structure right here. It's five blocks tall, it's twelve blocks width, and it's twenty blocks long. So you kinda wanna get lighting, it's gotta be all lighted up. I use lanterns because I'm in creative, but you can use redstones which are a little bit more cheaper. And you get to place pets, a lot of pets. I place them in order like this. It's a pretty efficient order. And the villagers, uh, you gotta bring two villagers through here. So you gotta keep metal doors so they won't escape. So what you basically gotta gotta do is gotta bring your villagers with a boat like this, and they're gonna get in right right here, and they're gonna select the bed, and they're gonna sleep in here, like this. And then right here you have food, and when they have food, they have kids. So that's basically how the whole thing works. I'm gonna show you the redstone upstairs. So we have a redstone clock right here, which is gonna go a full lap right here, and it's gonna gonna make the dispenser throw the food down. It's gonna give you a whole lap like this. There we go, and then it goes right here, and you gotta place another one right here. It goes like one, two, three. You gotta place two, then two redstone, and then go all the way over there, and then count two, and then the second one redstone, and then take all them. All of them like this. One, two, three. All, the, all, all, all of them. All of them. Three ticks. There we go. And also this ones so you give them two ticks like this. One, two. There we go. And you place them like this. And you place redstone bits around. And then you get the food. The potatoes. Only potatoes work. Remember that. Only potatoes. Then you get one. Then you get one. Then you get one. And then you get one. So basically, each time you go down, there you go. The villagers are right here. And if like I get some right there, they're gonna get the food. Right there, he got the food. And he's searching for his teammate to to have babies. There we go. They're gonna stay by the food. He got the food. They're gonna be babies with the time. And just wait for one to appear. Right there, maybe, maybe. Who knows? And they're gonna sleep in here, and they're gonna pick the bed, and they're gonna sleep in here at night. I'm gonna change the spit. Game rule. Okay, there we go. Stream. Game rule. No, not game mode. Game rule. There we go. And then we go... Random tick spit. Not that one. That one. And then we set it to a hundred. There we go. And I think they're gonna make their things faster. It's gonna wait. It's gonna appear. How much villagers do we have now? One, two, three, four, five. So it's five right now. Throw potatoes. See if they grab them. I'll leave them right now. Maybe that's why it's not working. So I'm gonna stay right here for a while. Meanwhile, they they do their things. I th I recommend you have your chest filled with potatoes right here, so you can constantly fill this, and you can take this to your pre-done village. Oh, I did something wrong. There we go. Place that right there. Now how much villagers we have? Now we have six. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Another one created. And they're gonna sleep at night right now. So I think that's pretty cool. And you can create your village with this. And basically if you wanna take a villager. There we go. There's babies. Here's a baby right here. You see it? A baby. So you place a boat right here. Search for a boat. There we go, and you kind of want to go like this, and go near a villager, like this, they're going to hop on the boat, right now, I don't know why it's not working, yeah, there we go, and you have your villager down there, and you can actually go like this, 
there we go and you press these two buttons and you go like this and you have your villagers right there and actually one hop there I don't know why it just glitched right there so you kinda wanna kill one and take one whatever you want this is a pretty cool trick you gotta use right now in your survival world cause the uh, villagers actually can trade you a lot of things that you cannot actually get only exploring but if you wanna stay home and you wanna have a lot of these mending books and enchanted books and OP swords and stuff you kinda wanna get this and get to your village I'm gonna do a video about a village creator so I think that's pretty much it thank you for watching please leave a like and subscribe